On today's video, I'm gonna show you how to light an ugly drum smoker. Follow with me and I'll show you what to do. So we're gonna roll this ugly drum smoker out real quick and get it out in the front yard here. And uh, you know, it's pretty sunny day, look at it. Hey, we got this ugly drum there. Okay, now we're getting our charcoal rack set on the burner. I like to use a uh, gas bottle and a burner to light my charcoal from the bottom, you know. And uh, be, be careful when you're hooking these up. You know, they're high pressure burners. This one here's got a red regulator. That's how you know it's high pressure. Now we're gonna pull all our guts out of the drum. You know, we gotta clean all this stuff up, but we gotta pull it also so we can get the uh, charcoal basket out. So there's the center of my special custom grate I made for myself here. It also doubles as a rib hanger. This here's our super tuner baffle plate. Um, I didn't clean it last time, so I gotta scrape all this food deposits off of it. And there's our draft master charcoal basket. I'm gonna pull it out of here. You know, last time I used this drum, you know, I had, oh gosh, probably 10 hour cook and there's a lot of charcoal left in it. I'm just kind of shaking it up a bit, getting the ash out of it, you know. So if you're gonna use wood in your charcoal basket, I definitely recommend that you use them like a fuse. You know, pull them in the corners where they get plenty of airflow to them. You know, surround them by charcoal. What's gonna happen is, is you'll see later when we dump our charcoal on top, that the, uh, our lit charcoal, that they're gonna have a nice, good pattern of coals around it. So we turn on the gas, light the burner here. And then uh, we're gonna set our charcoal chimney right on top of that grate. And we're gonna let the, let the flames kinda, that heat's gonna go straight up through that chimney. And uh, here in about, oh, five minutes, I'm gonna come shut the burner off and see the smoke there. We're just gonna let it light. So let's put our charcoal basket down inside the barrel. You know, that's our block off plate and our heat shield assembly that you see on our website. Now it's time to clean this off. So when we clean off this baffle plate, this is our super tuner. We're gonna be real careful not to bend the tabs, you know, too much, but when we get it all scraped off, the, the junk's gonna go down in the cooker. Now what I'm doing is I'm checking the tuning. I like to use my pinky finger as a gauge. I don't want them to be open too far. You know, the outside rim is about a half of an inch. You know, just flip it over and bend it where you need to to get it right. That's about perfect. Now we're gonna go ahead and dump our charcoal in the drum. See that salt and pepper color on top? And just be careful here. I'm wearing Cosmos Q, their high temperature glove. You can touch charcoal, but you can't hold it in the glove. You'll burn yourself. I'm just gonna kind of even this out a little bit. A couple swipes, you know. And uh, now we're ready to put our block off plate, our uh, super tuner plate in here. See there? perfect fit okay now you put your grate in and shut that lid as quick as you can because we don't want this thing to get too much air and start to spike up and uh, you're gonna set your dampers I like to start mine just almost all the way open on the stack and about one finger in the in the dampers here because I like to cook at 300 stick your finger in there and check it yeah there you go now uh, we're coming up to temp and uh, in this case, I didn't show you, but I did turn my dampers down a little bit because I wanted to show you that this thing will hold 225. And you know, if you want to build yourself one of these drum smokers like this, go to www.smokerbuildermfg.com or click the link in the bottom of this video. Now we're giving you a special deal here real quick. Be watching. There's another link in here if you'd like to go through and get the exact ugly drum smoker that Cosmos Q uses. In his videos, the black pretty one, click on that link and it'll take you over to a special website just for you. See ya! You gotta sneak up on it, see? Low and slow, baby.